Alright, hello hello everyone, this is Light Shadow, and today we are going back to Subnautica. So we're just going straight in to go forth and get to the remains, apparently, of a passenger. So we'll see what happens. I still want to get the seam off, but like mentioned last time, I need a mobile vehicle bay. So we'll just see if that can be managed. I do plan either this episode or next episode to check out the other big massive clouds, because I'm assuming that's another island. I think I might have booped it once, actually, one of the times I was exploring. So we shall see what we can manage. But yes, ah, we're coming back out into the red sand. At least that's what it looks like, even though it's not really red sands, per se. Okay, let's get to the surface while we can do so very easily. Okay, continuing. Hopefully we can find those fragments soon, though, because I would really like to make a sea moth, because that would be glorious. Oh great, this is leading us to an area that's hard to see in. That's just what we need. And the music to go with it to make us feel nervous. That is just what we need. And what looks like a big open space of death. That is just what I don't need. Where are we? Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Um... We just got another radio. But we're already close to this, so let's try to at least make it there. What is that? Are those here to eat me? Get close enough for one of them to get hostile at me. Okay, these don't seem to be the here. Biomass in this area is dominated by plant life. Picking up faint Altera vehicle signatures. Altera vehicle signatures, huh? Let's get to the surface, get some oxygen, then we'll look at the life pod. It's pretty much a straight dive down. Uh, this is gonna hurt a bit. Because <sighs> we are past the amount that it wants us to be. Leg! Let me go in. Thank you. Anything else? No, new then let's get data. going up. So I'm not seeing scannables. Well, this is kind of a cool area, to be honest. Well then. This thing's really cool. So let's go closer. I mean, at the very least, nothing here seems to want to eat me. I can appreciate this place. Alrighty. Let's go quick, quick, voice log. Live pod launch sequence initiated. Okay. Entering planetary atmosphere. My creators, the cherishers and sustainers of worlds, give me this day my daily pleasures as I give to those who seek pleasures from me. Okay. External temperature approaching critical levels. Show me the path in life, truth, and love for mine is the power. I am the one on and off and on again. Uh, it's been dark out. Life is a game 
which the universe plays with itself. I am done playing as this bundle of flesh. Return me. Well. Everything went there, and then it went night. Well then. Charge straight back to base because this place is terrifying and we had a radio signal. Welcome aboard, Captain. We made it back! Let's hear this radio message. This is Sunbeam. You know Aurora. We're from a little transgov on the far side of Andromeda, and we have a saying there. There's no bad without the good, no good without the bad. Sounds like you tasted a bunch of the former, but that only means you're overdue a whole lot of the latter. Might just be we're in. We're scanning for somewhere to park. We'll be in touch when we find it. Sunbeam out. Much happiness, so we'll be safe soon. Huh, that's actually kind of nice, so we won't actually have to live here for too much longer. And we have a lantern tree that's nearly fully grown, so we'll have fruit soon. This is going to be great. So much hopefulness already, but yes, thank you guys for watching this episode. Remember to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. And yeah, just all that normal stuff, but this is Light Shadow, signing out. Bye-bye, everybody.